Hi guys, welcome back to Curious Kids. Today is special because we have a special guest, Meat Star. My brand new kitty cat. And today, Star is going to help us build our air can. Let's build it. cannon is a little air vortex about the size of an opening in our cannon. When we made the smoke experiment with the air cannon, we could see the smoke rings. That's our air cannon towering donut shaped like a clunk of air. But you can also make this at home. Even if you don't have a Kiwi Crate subscriptions, me and my sisters, we just made three air cannons to play together. Now we're going to see who can knock down most pom-poms. hurricanes and even the puff of air coming from the air cannon we make are all vertices because they all have air spinning around in excess something special about the air vortices th their motion is stable and lasts longer than air disappeared like when you blow your birthday candles the air disappears very quickly but when we experience our air cannon with the smoke. The rings travel through all my room. Now, the hur now about the hurricanes. Those giant air vortexes travel across the, an ocean, and the air spinning keeps moving without falling apart. That's amazing and scary, right? If you're looking for a water vortex, just head for the bathroom and fill your sink with water, then pull out the stopper. There's a vortex. Flush the toilet. There's another one. Believe it or not, the dolphins use their blowholes to blow ring-shaped bubbles out of air, exactly like the vortex ring I created with my air cannon. Even more incredible, the dolphins then play with their vortex rings, chasing after them, swimming through them, or even biting them. So Star, did you like our experiments? Yeah? Well, I, I hope you did as well. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye!